What's up, YouTube? It's Nano Fiasco again. And this time, instead of just showing you what I do, I am going to show you how to make a homemade battle rocket. Okay. So, first off, the ingredient, or what you're going to need, a piece of fuse, preferably two inches to three inches long. I got mine out of a firecracker, so it's a little bit short. And I'm definitely not going to use it. I'm just going to show you how to make it and not actually shoot it off. Uh, model rocket motor. It can be the small ones or it can be the large normal ones. I prefer the small ones. They go higher and they don't curve to the side. Tissue. And a bamboo skewer. Now I'm going to show you with a already used model rocket motor because I don't have any more new ones. Okay. So you're going to want to take your fuse, put it in, tear off a piece of tissue, put it, set it on top, oops, yeah you can tell it's used. Put the fuse into where it won't go any farther and it's touching the powder then poke the tissue around it to where you can pick it up and it won't come out. Okay, that's the engine already done. Next you want to get some duct tape or electrical tape and tape it to this, to the bamboo skewer. And that's pretty much it. If you want to put some crushed up sparklers at the end, like you crush it up, pour it in, and put a piece of tape over it so it doesn't come out, and that'll give it a sparkle effect. And hopefully my mom won't come in and ruin this video again. Um, so that's basically how to make it. And if you want to, you can also take this and not tape it to the bamboo skewer, but tape it to a model car or a little Hot Wheels car. Tape it like that. Put a coffee stir, tape it to the bottom. I use straws and they turn out horribly and run a string, preferably not a fishing line. A cotton string works best. I tried fishing line and it cut the straw, so. And it goes away and you'll probably never find it again. So that's how you make a mono rocket car slash bottle rocket.